So, we're in the middle of a hellacious thunderstorm. I got some cheapy Amazon shocks that I bought. Let's take a look. So, they're really packaged pretty uh, horribly. Just two shocks stuffed in a box. They got a little bubble wrap on them. Kind of crazy to think they came all the way from China like this. So, if you look at them, Basically the same as the OE shocks. Down to the spanner wrench adjusts the, uh, the spring preload. Kind of a cheesy version of it. Does have some rubber bushings. Along with the metal sleeves. Let's check the overall length. See if it is what it says it is. Fourteen point five. Does appear as though this is basically an exact replica, as close as China could get it. Man, listen to that thunder! As close as they could get it over in China to your factory Banshee shocks. But let's take a measurement and uh, see if the width is the same. So these. With the sleeve, inch and a quarter. Top and bottom. My tape's a little bit. Let's take a look. So as you can see, the ones I have are looking pretty beat. Let's take some measurements, see how they compare. And look at that. Might be hard to see, but inch and a quarter exactly. So that appears to be in a good factory replica the biggest thing and i was originally going to buy some oversized ones uh say like off of a 4 dr i chose not to the reason i chose not to is i'm trying my best to replicate this uh as what i would have had uh you know in in this era when I was riding when I was a kid. Not a kid, but you know, a kid. All right, so overall length, 14 inches. So my answer to that is it's probably sagging as opposed to, you know, the wrong length. Eh, not much, but you know, I'm gonna have to say that's probably the reasoning. But we'll do a follow-up to this and let you know how things turned out. But Banshee's coming along. Like I said, my garage is a mess. I say that every video just about. But uh, yeah, it's coming along. I've got a video. Uh, I don't know if I published it yet. Of uh, you know how to change decals. And uh, soon I'm going to have another video coming up of uh, some Team Alba beadlocks that I've got. And uh, we'll install them and do some comparison. But uh, make sure you subscribe, like the video. I could use some subscribers. Channel's starting out. I really haven't done any advertising because I don't really have any content. And I don't really have a good way to make video besides my phone. And these camera phone videos probably suck really bad to watch. But thank you very much, guys. Appreciate it. If you want to see something in the video, let me know. I was thinking of buying some A-arms, putting them on. Just because uh, she looked like she could use some A-arms for a little bit wider stance. But stay tuned, guys. Thank you for watching.